Greetings and salutations viewers, it is I, Cybertron X, coming to you with a new figure review. But first I want to wish a very special happy birthday to Slagos Legos 3000. Um, got to know you a while back, made friends with you. Um, you're a great guy, I hope you have a great day. Uh, once again, Slagos, happy birthday. Now, I'm coming to you with a action figure review. And first of all, let me get the box out so you can see this. It is from Palisade Figures. And this came out in about 2001, 2000, and, but um, it is the Final Fantasy Spirits Within 12-inch Jane Proudfoot action figure. This is the box, uh, really nice, really nice box for the figure. Um, the front of it opens up for the figure itself, nice inner nice inner box in that really nice I mean you get some really nice storyline of what's going on inside and I should turn down my volume on my computer now let's go on to the figure review this is Jane Proudfoot from the spirits within you can see it's a really nice 12 inch figure real cloth Outfit. Uh, she is, has the um, the uh, the marine outfit that she wore in there, carrying the gun to fight the ghost. Uh, one of her other accessories. It's a nice little knife that I keep here so I don't lose it. Helmet is removable when it wants to be. As you can see here, really nice hel helmet for the figure. Very show accurate. Um, really nice detail on the head and on the gun itself let's go ahead and take off the gun show show up the gun this is the gun that the marines use to fight the ghosts or the spirits or the aliens from the movie really nice kind of looks like if you look like that kind of looks like a aircraft carrier from Matt Cross so a oh, really nice little accessory really nice detail weaponry uh, this part right here is actual metal so that's really nice. Uh, there's the knife once again. Kind of crooked. It actually came in the box. So I'm, I got to flatten it out somehow. So it would be nice and normal. I uh, kind of figured that it. it oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh. I think it attaches on the gun right there. I didn't know. Oh. Let's. Let's go back to the figure. I'm rambling. As you can see, really nice detail, articulation in the hands, 360, arms. Um, any other possibility is hindered by the outfit because a lot of the armor that you see is actually sewn to the outfit itself. Um, some really nice camo detail that's been ironed onto the figure itself. don't know if you can really see some of the detailing that's been put onto this figure. It's a really, really nice 12 inch figure. Looks exactly how she did from the show. As you can tell, uh, the sh show the movie was, it wasn't really all that interesting but I found this figure and I thought it'd be nice to have it. Um, so very neutral colors um I mean, it's all gray except for her head. Um, doesn't want to stand. Uh, but, you know, it's a really nice, interesting, detailed figure. Uh, Palisades was known to make some really nice figures. So, if you can find this on eBay um, at a good price, get it. I got this on clearance, but I've actually seen these things run for a good $30, $40. Um, uh, it's a good figure if you're a collector of the 12 inch of any 12 inch figure. So, um, if you want to get it, get it. If not, it's something you can pass on. But you know, it's nice. Um, this is Cybertron X with uh, the 12 inch Jane Proudfoot figure. Um, Till all are one. Farewell.